Jingle bell, jingle bell, jingle all the way. Heaven and the nature sing. Heaven and the nature sing. Well, I never realized my heaven nature toy collector got heaven and nature in a Christmas song. Well, first of all, I would like to wish you all Merry Christmas in 2020. So we've been through a very uneasy year in 2020. So. This year, we're not really going to celebrate the Christmas gathering and also go to church. So that's why I will take this opportunity to show a quick product review with you guys. It's about Captain America helmet produced by Killer Body. As you all know, this product also uh, on my own cost. It's not a sponsored video. So if you like this video, please hit a thumbs up, share the video and subscribe to the channel. Let's get started. Alright, basically the product comes with a brown shipper box and the art box. The art box is just a simple Avengers Endgame. Actually, this is a navy blue. Alright, so it's nothing special, that's all. Alright, and inside come with this black protecting foam. Okay, this that's all. So let's look at the main product. Alright, here we go. This is the Captain America helmet produced by Killer Body. So let's have a 360 degree quick lens. First of all, we look at the material. So this one, I think is actually uh, made by ABS plastic. The material is, is like a, something, some sort of a Marvel Legend Iron Man helmet material. But this one is a bit slightly softer a bit, alright? But still it's hard plastic. And you can see here it's uh, something like a similar like a carbon fiber but not really carbon fiber okay okay the color for this blue color actually uh, is quite shiny if you under the the bright light or light something like a shiny blue but uh, actually in the movie i believe it's more darker than this one right this is gray Okay, so you can see there's a little bit of weathering effect purposely paint on the A, Captain America A, and also on the top and at the back. Okay. And on the side wing. Alright. So this is the inner side, you can see. There's a come with a um, sponge. Wait a moment. Okay, this is the foam, black foam, and here the padding. And this is, I think, is a is a leather. I'm not sure whether it's genuine or the fake leather. Okay, here also have the padding. This is a soft material. Okay, I think should be medium to hard rubber or plastic okay it's got a buckle here this is out this one i'm not sure whether it's a die cast or a plastic i can't really sure this is a screw okay according to the movie but this one uh, actually to me it's not 100 percent accurate I have been feedback to Killer Body, but they not really take my advice. Okay, first of all, we look at the color. It's not the uh, shine. I mean, if you look at the camera or even on your bare eyes, it's not really the dark blue color. 
okay this is uh, in between okay slightly little bit gloss I'm not really glossy but I slightly reflect the light okay and by the way I shooting this video beside the window so it looks like a bit bright okay okay this leather uh, if based on the movie it's supposed to be more wide more longer slightly longer a little bit okay and um, the chin and the stripe supposed to be uh, more like the like the brown okay I how I not really know how to describe but if let's say I find the picture I will show it here but Captain America in different movie the the strap and the chin also got slightly different variation color okay so this is the fake metal buckle okay I'm not sure whether it's a real metal or ABS okay so in the movie suppose this part have a two screw on the top okay I also feel bad to them but uh, they already produced the mold and the prototype so they are unable to do the amendment all right okay so if let's say in terms of the details and also the pricing I think this one should be the quite competitive and option in the market because last time I do own a cat toys one cat toy is a soft rubber expandable soft rubber and the Taurus studio one is uh, quite accurate but that one is a statue most of us cannot wear the helmet because the head the size is too small but then this one uh, suitable for the size 59 centimeters the head size so um, let's try it out and see what was the result there's one more thing in a movie actually this area is not supposed to be half color it's supposed to from here to here okay the first and the second wing is aligned but the third wing is supposed, supposed to be shorter but uh, they painted this area which is not so accurate but uh, in terms of the price you can accept what you get Alright, so I'm gonna try this Captain America helmet. Okay, so uh, let's try this. I can do this all day. Okay. okay, so for me, after I wearing this, still got slightly got space and quite a bit loose. So for those cosplayer, uh, experienced cosplayer, they will add some padding or foam at the back of the head so you can uh, make it more fixed position. Looks better when you wear this helmet. Okay. So this is adjust. Okay. Okay, so this is gonna be the results. Uh, uh, to me, I would say this part is slightly a bit bigger because it's a plastic, so it won't be worked perfectly like a head shape. I mean, the helmet outlook, but. Uh, for costly and also for display purpose, I think this is uh, good enough. And this gap is quite a bit bigger. Maybe just for my size, okay? Maybe for a Westerner, maybe your size is bigger. Maybe you wear much better than me, so I'm not sure. But this is just my uh, personal point of view. Okay. 
So after wearing this, I think it's quite comfortable. Uh, not, I don't feel that uh, very tight. But I believe Captain America helmet is actually designed for best fit for the head size. So the outlook will be better. Okay, this one is too close. After I adjust it. I think if you are Westerner or your, your, your head shape is longer enough, so maybe you can wear this more nice. Okay. So let's look up, look at the exterior size. Well, uh, I think most probably you guys will ask me, is it this helmet suitable for a motorcycle or bicycle? I would say uh, maybe yeah because the material I think some sort of the cycle, uh, cyclist helmet material but if you talk about uh, motorcyclist helmet I don't think it's good enough for protection uh, just a layer of protection but not a really safety measure If you want to fight war, you must wear a uniform. <coughs> Alright, let's check out the size for display. Okay, so from here to here is about 20 to 20. Okay, wait a moment. It's about 21 to 22. Okay, so on the height, on the height. Second is about 23, 22, 23. Okay, so for the front, let's check the front. The front is about 15 centimeters. Okay, so let's check out the weight. All right, let's check out the weight. The weight is about 847 gram equals to about 850 grams. Okay. All right. It's time for me to give a conclusion. Overall, this is a nice Captain America helmet, which is produced by Killer Body. But this one is not 100% uh, movie accurate. I would say up to 80% of the movie accurate. So, but in terms of the design and also the material, I think it's, I think it's a nice pickup, right? So let's have a 360 degree quick glance. If you are the perfectionist, you want to go for a very higher uh, movie accurate, maybe you can go for a custom made. But this one is a mass production. If you only for display, I think it should be good enough for you. Um, if you want to buy this Captain America helmet, I still have a very limited stock. You can reach me out at heavenagentoyglactor.gmail.com or you send me a Facebook message, heavenagentoyglactor. I'll put the link down on the description below. So, this is it. The week is over and uh, today is a Christmas day. I wish you all have a very pleasant Christmas and together with your family. Happy Nature Toy Collector signing out. Peace. Avengers! Assemble.